your local weather authority forecast. It's a pleasant start across the basin, but things will get pretty interesting later today after the heat up. There's a chance for thunderstorms. This is a live look at the tall city early on your Thursday morning. Still dark out there. We're under night vision. Clear skies and slightly cooler air. That's the big story this morning. The dark skies indicating the very clear skies this morning. Satellite and radar showing most of the clouds north and west of Midland and Odessa. Rain activity kind of diminishing in intensity. This monsoonal flow of clouds and rain activity again west, generally of the basin, but that flow will start to move a little bit closer here into the northern basin later today after the heat up. We could be seeing the chance for thunderstorms. But speaking of that heat, heat advisories throughout much of the basin. That's in effect until 9 p.m. Central Time, 8 p.m. Mountain Time. This does include Hector and Midland counties down to Fork Stockton, Alpine, Marfa, down to the Rio Grande, especially in Presidio County. Temperatures near the Rio Grande. Above 115 or more, please limit your time outdoors. We are likely to smash record high temperatures across the region today. But we've got a ways to go. Mostly clear skies. 81 right now in the tall city with a 42% relative humidity value. Winds pretty calm for now. Radiational cooling taking into effect, meaning the clear skies, the lighter winds, and slightly drier air throughout the atmosphere, allowing temperatures to drop from yesterday. Now, we were pretty hot yesterday, but again, those temperatures are dropping this morning, generally in the 70s in northern areas, upper 70s, lower 80s in around Midland and Odessa, 60s in Marfa, 70s in Alpine, mid to upper 80s in Presidio. This model actually underestimating how warm we are right now in Presidio, and those temperatures not dropping too much more by the morning commute, and then really heating up this afternoon. In the high 90s and triple digits, even in the mountain strain of the Guadalupe Mountains to Marfa and Alpine, the high 90s and low triple digits, but well above 100 today in the tall city, right around 108, 109. Average high this time of year is 96 degrees, average low 73. Daily record high temperatures set back in 2011, 105. If we reach 109 this afternoon, which is what I'm predicting, we'll break that record by at least four degrees. But a little bit of a cooler start this morning at 78. Again, yesterday morning, it was a bit of a warmer start in the lower 80s. So finally breaking below the 80 degree mark. But again, we will become a little bit more humid with a chance for thunderstorms after the heat up this afternoon. When the thunder roars, please go indoors. And with that, we have to watch out for that fire threat because of the hot and breezy conditions eventually cooling off into more of a maybe stormy pattern for some in the Trans-Pecos. A few thunderstorms popping up in the Davis Mountains and just east of Midland, Odessa toward Big Lake, Big Spring, moving on to the east later this evening tonight with leftover thunder showers tonight to early tomorrow morning in the mountains to rain. Low temperatures in the 80s with partly cloudy skies, a little more humid because of easterly winds bring in the uptick in humidity. So tomorrow morning it will be a little bit muggy, but tomorrow afternoon it will be heating up, but with some clouds, it will be a little bit less hot than today, right around 105 by 3 p.m. If you guys are picking up those, those kiddos from school, make sure you guys stay hydrated and stay cool out there. 109 today, 107 tomorrow, so heating up a little bit more after you guys perhaps pick up those kiddos from school tomorrow. Seasonably hot air this weekend and remaining seasonably hot through next week.